Survivor community. Today I want to share with you some tips for being an advocate on social media. Being an advocate on social media is important to me because that's how I found Survivor. I actually found Survivor through the hashtag Survivor. The first tip that I have is to actually use the hashtags Survivor, We Are Survivor, I'm a survivor, and of course, if you are a survivor ambassador, please use the hashtag survivor ambassador. The second tip is when you're sharing on social media, make sure that your posts are shareable. When you are sharing a post for advocacy purposes, make sure that it's public and can be shared. The third tip is to try to share content that is not just for cervical cancer. And what I mean by that is when we only share one thing, often our audience starts to tune out and become dismissive of our posts. So we want to make sure that we are sharing other content peppered in throughout our advocacy content. So make sure you're sharing things about yourself, maybe your family, if you're traveling somewhere, so people will continue to stay engaged with your posts. Which brings me to number four. We want to interact with other people on social media, even if they're not posting about cervical cancer. Often as advocates, we get frustrated when people don't like, share, or comment on our content. If we expect people to do that for our posts, we need to do that for others. You would be surprised at who is actually following you, and if you will start commenting and sharing other people's content, more than likely, they're gonna do the same for you. Number five, we want to make sure that we are sharing reputable content. An excellent place to find content is the survivor.org website. It is a treasure trove of information. Share survivor content. Number six, be mindful of how often you post. If you post five things in an hour, more than likely, you've lost your audience. Be mindful of when you post. Maybe even try to post something in the morning, middle of the day, and evening, for example. If you constantly post throughout the day, it gets lost in the feed of your audience. My seventh tip is to be authentic. People want to feel like they're part of your story. Share with them. This doesn't mean that you have to share everything all at once, but people do want to feel like they're part and they want to follow along. So get out there and advocate. Use social media. It's right here in your hand. It's so easy. Do it.